Things are about to get good. The following contest is an Extreme Rules match. Making his way to the ring from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 160 pounds, David J. The tension building for this match is so thick you can cut it with a knife. A lot of drama involved with this one. A man who always gets a strong reaction from the WWE Universe, and it will only intensify once the bell rings. Here comes the 330 pounder, Bronson Reed. And his opponent from Black Forest, South Australia, weighing in at 330 pounds, Bronson Reed. Bronson Reed tips the scales with over 330 pounds, but is the agility of a man half his size? Though when that tsunami comes crashing down, you'll know you ain't facing a cruiserweight. Bronson Reed is indeed ready for war. I have a feeling we're just moments away from another jaw-dropping, pardon me, Stu, tsunami! I have a feeling we're about to learn a lot about these superstars and what makes them tick in this Extreme Rules match. Hoisted high up across the shoulders into a sit-out axe driver. Will that clinch things for Reed? Within inches of victory, only to have it snatched away. This match just keeps getting more and more exciting. I can't tell if it's anger in the eyes of the fact that he hasn't finished this or if it's disbelief that his opponent is still in this. We've seen the length superstars are willing to go to in an Extreme Rules match to earn the victory. What do you have to do to get yourself in that mindset? Well, it's all about adapting in Extreme Rules. You really have to be creative and maybe even a little crazy if you want to succeed. Somehow still has the energy for a quick kick out. Wrenching the arm. Driven all the way down for a European arm breaker. Dragon Slayer! Oh my goodness! Good night. Connie gets out. Perhaps some renewed life in him now. Oh! Oh, well scouted. This is quickly turning into a slugfest. Oh, ouch! That gets reversed on Reed. See an answer for every move attempted. Hanging back with their own counter. Giving up now is not an option. They have to finish this. Looks like a hockey fight just broke out. Looks like we've got ourselves a brawl here. Ah, uh, a hip press. And a feel. He's going for the pin. This could be it. Still only got one. I can't believe it. He just won't go away. And he's taking this to the outside now. Now it's really about... Look out! Suicide die! Whatever it takes to win. A roll of the dice and it pays off in full. Staved off that attack. Everyone get out of the way. Dragon Slayer! 
Oh, my goodness. Hardy breaks free, but will the damage prove to be irreparable? Across the shoulders into a sit-out axe driver. Can Reed close it out? Just burying their opponent with that trash can. Climbs back inside. And he has free reign to the outside with no countouts to worry about. He went right into that turnbuckle. He turns it around. He gets out of the way. Hooked him up. High angle belly to back suplex. Reed about to come crashing down. Will that clinch things for Reed? Oh, kick out, kick out in two. Wow, looks like this book has a couple more chapters in it. We might be seeing a whole saga written tonight. This was the moment to capitalize on. That should have been the end. Just pinning the arm down and then dropping the knee for more punishment. Was mounted with punches. And not, oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Uh -oh. No telling what's underneath the ring tonight. Brad's decision making there proved to be extremely detrimental. Can you recover from such an error? You have to wonder. Connecting on the DDT. And what's he looking for here? Clearly thinking a steel chair is what's needed right about now. And Reed is now in a demoralizing spot. Yeah, Reed's defensive instincts need to kick in. Throw him back in under the ropes. <sighs> Stiff head. Run. Trying to wrestle free their opponent's arm. Has the arm trapped. Delivering nasty stops. Got it scouted. went from bad to worse. Our right hand. No, 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 no. This, this is bad news. No way. Oh. Lights out. This is troublesome for Reed. Oh, my. And the resiliency to win this one. Bronson Reed tonight. Big Bronson Reed's going to be in one heck of a bad mood for the foreseeable future. I would definitely steer clear of him in the locker room after this loss.